classes in session, Professor Jay here. Welcome back to Paper Mario, the Origami King. It's time to meet a god. It's a temple? Sure. Ooh. Legend says the spirit of the dirt, known as the Earth Velumental, lives in this very cave. It is a mighty spirit imbued with the power to lift the very ground. It is no wonder that the meek and modest Koopa Troopa venerate it so, via pilgrimage and gifts. Oh, how informative. Shelvation. To one with a creative mind, these fortuitously formed formations may resemble the earth valumental. Indeed. One may pay respects to its hallowed shell in this very spot, as many Koopa Troopas do. Notably, the Earth Velumental's shell is even stouter than this rock, which is itself impervious to damage. This is reminding me of the park. We did a playthrough of that on the channel. It's super, super creepy. Does that rock look like the Earth Velumental to you, Mario? I don't really see it, to be honest. All right. Let's learn more. Pain point. It's said this claw-shaped gouge was created by the Earth Velumental in an epic battle. Mario? Hey, if it's really you, Mario, you've got to help me. What? <laughs> it's a toad! What? Oh, wow, thank you so much. What? I knew it. All right, it was probably me. I ripped out a bunch of gears and wires and stuff while I was in there. Uh, let's put in some coins. I'll give you the spiel. Oh, is there more? Okay. Ahem. Let's see, where was I? Oh, yeah, they think this was the giant gouge in the wall. It was made by the Earth Volume Metal. But... This part's important. They also say that its claws were like its weakest attack. The attack that will really get you is when it launches rocks out of its mouth. So, um, watch out for that, I guess. Informative AF. Footsteps of the Elders. Oh. The following section of the path has been left in its historically authentic, uneven state. Please watch your step. Fun. Why isn't that one on? He. Oh! I just want to see the Earth Valley Mental. Now I've heard that recording more than 400 times. It gets better every time. A true believer. Hey. Come here, buggos. Oh, yeah. That's right, Mario. Now I can get back to my shop. It's the local fun, funky, and functional accessories outlet. I'm set up just outside the temple. Come see me if you need any accessories, okay? What about you? I'm regular. You know, I read a book about this once. Somehow, I still didn't feel prepared for it when it happened to me. Okay. 50 coins. You are looking at a holy image representing the full glorious form of the Earth Valumental itself. Although the spirit is fully invincible, kindly direct your attention now to the beast's great tail. In certain tales, the spirit's still formidable hind portion is described as less than 100% invisible. Invincible. It is this combination of great power and weakness that has endeared the Earth Valumental to so many. This marks the last spot on the temple tour. Consider donating generously and frequently. What if I hit it? Huh? Is this the end? It's kind of a letdown, isn't it? Hmm, this might be silly, but maybe it's worth a try. Dear Earth Valumental, if you're there, please find it in your heart to lower the rocky pile keeping us from the streamer. Lastly, 
Thank you for all of your generous gifts and, um, turtly goodness. <laughs> well, that did nothing. Now I'm all embarrassed for trying. Mario, do something, please. What if I hit it? Oh, knock, knock, knock. Whoa, you knocked the Earth Valley Metal completely over. Look at the toads. Um, do you think we'll be cursed now? What's the usual punishment for messing up a divine site? Eternal damnation! Huh? Is it just me, or is it super drafty all of a sudden? Oh. Ah, the cave keeps going! Ooh, I can't wait to see what's ahead. It's like a behind-the-scenes tour. So exciting. Yes, I too am excited. Let us share. Oh, okay. Um. Okay, cool. Funky. Give me that funky junky save point. Ow. Took that for granted, didn't I? Oh, Lord. I also thought those two were next to each other. I'm an idiot. Part of me is like, let's just uh, load that save. Damn it. I didn't think it would go up that high. Okay, I'm just going to kill myself, I guess. Let's try this again. Only with more patience. Wow. The first one is straight to the right. Then there's this one. Okay, this one appears to be totally next to it. Oh. Okay. Jeez. That was demanding. Slash, I'm an idiot. Oh, see, but they knew I was an idiot. Yay! Good game design. Oh, that's boss battley if I've ever seen an angle such as this. Ooh, look at that. Turtly goodness. That's way more impressive than anything we've seen so far. I want to climb inside that thing's mouth. Is that weird? Let's do it anyway. <laughs> All right. By the way, I hope this doesn't jinx us, but I feel like we haven't seen any folded soldiers for a while. Oh, but, uh, but, but, ma'am. Eek, because I can summon them. I want to avoid. Ha ha! You can't get me now. Oh, there's a toad back there. How on earth do we get to him? Oh, from up here, I suppose. Again? Aha! Just in time. Oh. What are these? Shiny boots. Oh, but can't stop spiked enemies. Okay. For the boss battle, I presume. Yeah, this is going to take me down, isn't it? Yes. But then how do I get in there? Oh, right. Okay. Got it. I can't see. I can't see. Oh, there you go. Oh, dear. Crap. Yeah. Gotta fight him. This dude has glasses. Sunglasses, even. What a rad dude. Okay. Very good. Wonderful. Great lineup. Not perfect, though. Interesting. I wonder why. Let's see if a regular boots will do it on these swoops. I think they do, right? Uh, when you're crushing your command inputs like that. Hex, yeah. Alright, um... Let's just try your standard jumpies, I guess. Oh! Fun! Battle bonus! I did it! Save a friend. Oh, thank you! I can't tell you how long I've been trapped in here. I'm actually the curator of this exhibit, you see. I realized the divine image I crafted for my imagination alone was a bit lacking. So I came here in search of the real thing. Yes, I admit the exhibit is a bit of a coin grab, but did I deserve to be folded so harshly by those swoops? Yeah, probably. Anyway, be careful on your way out, Mario. All right, sunglasses toad. Shady toad. I wonder what, if anything different happens now that he's been freed. Okay, we can't get up there, so now we need to use this.
Let's go. Okay, into here. Okay. La da dee, la da do. Oh, hello. We don't want to be shoved off now, do we? A shiny hammer! Cool! I should probably equip some of these weapons, huh? Let's do that. Um. Yes. Yes. Hey! What? Alright. Oh, how on earth? Oh, okay, you just have to be a quick little guy. Uh, uh, uh. No? Really? I feel like that should be destroyed. Maybe up here? Hmm. Where am I meant to go? Off the side? Oh, that scared me. <laughs> hey, rocks! Wow, really glad that I have this model of rocks. Roxanne. You don't have to put on the red line. Walk the streets for money. Oh, is that a bad dude? F. Oh, but I only get the one attack? You flopping kidding me? Oh, but these ones died. Weird. Oh, because I got the power up. Ah, got it. It really is worth it to take the time and make sure you get that. Hey, here we go. Wait, but what did that accomplish? Definitely something weird. Side of a so sh stone shifty rock? That one? No. Ooh! Oh, that's crafty. I thought I saw more off to the left. Maybe I'm wrong. Whatever. Here we go. Let's celebrate. You and me, it's party time, guys. I did the thing. Feel like I'm on a school field trip or something. I guess class is in session. Haha! <laughs> Into here! Smashy? Oh dear! The cavern did not like that. Haha! <laughs> I avoided. Well, Mario, these traps are actually on fire. Please be careful, okay? If you get hurt, I hope you remember you can press Y to use a healing item. Thank you. We'll just walk very carefully. Oh dear. Oh, we can't go that way. Oh, F! Being on fire sucks. Holy crap! Ah, there's an opening. Excellent. I need that. Oh, this doesn't look fantastic. <laughs> Celebrate. There we go. I wonder if there's anything on these other sides. Oh, crap. I was meant to run left. That's your big gap. After this third one. No, not even. Oh, F! Oh, you can run inside of it! I see! Okay. Now we got it figured out. Whee! You spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record player, right, right round. Good times. Give me that sweet save. Oh, hello. Oh, toasty! Oh, that was close. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! 
Uh-oh. Let me tell you what I don't like. Haha, <laughs> I got it. Just in time. Oh. In time to die. Here we go. There's the hole. Nice. I did the everything. Ooh, that was close. You're already pretty flat, but that thing would have really flattened you. Ah, uh, but I should have known you'd figure out a way, nice way to something safely, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Indiana Jones. Indiana Jones. Max up part. Ooh. Tell me, yes, I was about to say, tell me it also gives me a full heal. I like that. <gasps> it's a max up heart? Hooray! Incredible. What does it do? I mean, this is just a guess, but it looks like you got a bit more HP now, Mario. And is it just me, or do you look a bit stronger, too? Wow, those max up heart things are great. Cue the people out there who are already planning on beating this game without collecting any of the max hearts. I am not among them. Ah, uh, here we are. Wonderful. Let's just pull off the king's thing. Hooray! Now we can go in the mouth. Olivia, we made it. Okay, we made it. Okay, valumental statue. We're heading into your mouth. I hope you brushed your holy teeth. Gross. Well, if it's meant to be like a Koopa Troopa, it wouldn't have any teeth now, would it? All right, that's just a drop down. Okay. Here we go! I'm assuming boss battle time. Ah, yes. If we weren't already certain. We are now. Well, collect every bit of confetti, why not? Hip, hop, the hip, the hip to the hip, hip, hop. You don't stop rocking to the bang, bang, boogie. Here we go. Wait, it's just a big empty hole? How disappointing! <laughs> Cute things that people say about the Grand Canyon. Where's the Earth Valumental? We've come so far to see you! Hold on, what's that? Was what? Uh, great job, Olivia. This is all your fault. Look at all this filth. So I'm not the best judge of footing, as we've just learned. Sorry, Mario, I'd teach you how to float if I could. You're not even gonna try? Anyway, I was looking down at this odd green spot before you fell down. What do you think it is? Soccer field. Oh boy. We are on the Earth Valumental. It's the big Koopa boy. Why are you so ornery? It's the Earth Valumental and it's made of origami. Eek, it's so cool. <laughs> Olivia just trying to force the developmenters opinions the developments blah, developers opinions down our throats oh no I don't think it's very friendly right now maybe because it got all folded up when it's like this I'm afraid we have we may have no choice but to fight it yeah we know to hit it in the booty it's boss battle time class now we know that it's claws are it's weak attack and that shooting rocks is the bad one Wow, this Valumental looks just as powerful as I hoped it would. That shell looks super sturdy. Its body must be well protected. Makes those little legs look kind of vulnerable, doesn't it? Hmm. Use the arrows. Oh, this is totally different. This is our first boss battle. I've been itching to try one of these. The Earth Valumental's in the center this time. Your attacks won't reach it from way out here. You'll have to get closer, but it looks like something weird has happened to the rings. And what's up with those arrows scattered all over? Should we follow them? Let's give it a shot. My hunch is right. We'll need to start with the start. Let's try to place one of the arrows on the space in front of you. Okay. Looks like you can select and move the rings just like regular battles. Select the outer rings so we can place this arrow under the red circle on your starting space. Bingo! That's the ring! Now rotate until the arrow is under the circle and our first move will be in place. I went the wrong way. Okay. Yeah, my hunch was right! Okay, so once you step on an arrow, you'll keep moving in that direction until you step on another arrow. If we keep that in mind, we'll be able to create a path that puts us right in front of the Earth Valumental. Alright. 
It's like uh, old school Pokemon when you stand on the uh, slidey platforms. The arrows are already leading us to the Earth Valley Mental. Hmm. I guess getting to the right spot's only half the job. What's next? Ooh, that panel must be your way to attack. Try placing the action panel under the circle and see what happens. That's it. Now spin the ring. All right. The other way. So... Way to go, Mario! You made it to the Earth Valley Mental! Now it's time to attack! Let's see... Different attacks are probably going to affect different areas. Try to aim your attack in an area where it won't bounce right off. Okay. Um... Oh, wait. Well, we're gonna hit the... Are we hitting its... I don't know if we're hitting its, uh... Shell or its... Arm. Whatever. BAM! That only did eight. Ooh! Yes! You would have bounced right off that hard shell, but attacking its legs seemed to be pretty effective. Okay. So we'll stick to hammers. Oh no, I think the Earth Valley Mental is winding up for an attack. Try to guard against it at the right time. Press A. Yeah, here we go. Oh. Oh, gosh! That's it, Mario. You still took some damage, but it could have been a lot worse. I only blocked one of them. What are you talking about? That was pretty bad. Okay, what's next? What's next? Why not aim for its right front leg? Jeez, you're just telling me all the everything, aren't you? Another one. Oh, Ah, just great. Oh, but it still worked. Yeah, just like that. Alright, here we go. Oh my gosh, I still only blocked one of them. Grr. Use the arrows. Ooh, but health though. Because it's not a leg. Duh. I didn't consider that. Oh, it still did a little damage, but not much. Alright. I blocked two of them that time. Haha! <laughs> Smart. Awesome. Okay. We got the leg. I think I've got it figured out. Excellent! Now I just need to get the other leg, and then I'll go for that tail. Ah, block two. Still okay. Not phenomenal, but what are you going to do? Uh, can I do this? Yeah. What, what the heck is going to be... Is this Paper Mario's invitation to smash? The earth element of shell is super sturdy. Jump attacks will always bounce right off it. Aim for its exposed limbs. Get up close and personal with your hammer. Oh, it's hints. That's cool. I like that. Let's go. And I'm glad that there are healing items that are available in battle. Alright. We've got all but the tail now. Alright. I got the timing down. Awesome. Let's hit that booty. I wonder if I wore, like, good boots if it would still do some damage. Yeah, that did not do much. Ah! Only two blocks that time. Ah, just... Oh, it did seven, though. Oh. Wow. Okay. Now his tail is exposed! Okay! I guess this'll be it, and then I'll be able to get him with a thousand fold arms. Okay. This is involved! Ooh, that is his weak point. Yeah, he did not like that. Its tail must be super tender. Oh, dear. Whoa, what's up with the Earth Value Mental? Its legs are tucked inside. This might be our chance to try a cool move. Well, let's try a cool... Oh, I see it. Ooh, ooh, is that... It is! It's a thousand fold arms magic circle! If you can get to that magic circle, I can activate the thousand-fold arms. It probably works the same way as action panels, so try to place it at the end of your route. Hey, now we got it. It's thousand-fold arms time, baby. Magic circle on. Let's grab a turtle. Woo! Now I can hop on him. Oh, what? Hit him over and over? Wait, let me say one quick thing. 
Be aware of your surroundings. Please don't shake your controller too wildly. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was pretty fun. Yes, you did it, Mario. I am the best. Wow, that was interesting. Cool. Turtle down. Will he turn back into a nice paper friend? Or will we just absorb his soul and become one with the turtleness? He turned into a book. Huh? Did it just shrink down into something tiny? It sure did. The Earth Bibliofold. Did you somehow turn the Earth Velumental into a book, Mario? That's a holy scripture right there. Ooh, it's instructions for folding into the Earth Velumental itself? Uh, maybe this is its way of helping us. Let's see. Ah, uh, yes, mountain fold here, valley fold there. Whoa! I just had this strange feeling like the spirit of the Earth Velumental is inside me. Are you saying you're feeling the Holy Spirit? Maybe we should try using that magic circle? Velumental power. What? 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 Olivia, is this your final form? What? I'm a turtle! That's bonkers. How do I look? Powerful, imposing, magnificent, maybe even a little cute? That's like I'm the Earth Elemental. I'm a turtle. I definitely feel powerful. Like I could really shake things up in here. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna dance it out! What? Yes. Oh my gosh. Go Olivia. Go Olivia. Go Olivia. It's your birthday. This is not what I was anticipating. That was weird as hell. Ta-da! <laughs> okay. What came over me? It was so fun to wield all that turtle power. <laughs> Heroes in a half shell. I guess I can use any magic circle that belongs to the Earth Velumental now. Hey, that means I should be able to lower the tower back to a reasonable but still scary height. <laughs> reasonable but still scary. Okay, into the pipe, I guess. Ray. Oh, ah, uh, F. I didn't. I didn't mean it. Give me back my stuff. Ah, go in the thing. We. Hey, didn't anyone ever teach you not to step on the gods? You step on our god, you get a divine punishment. Hey, I'm worshiping here. Oh, I see that buggo. Give me that. That's a toad friend. Oh, I was just getting the hang of being a bug. I had a great little hiding spot picked up to freak out the next pilgrim. Pilgrim? Ooh, 100% toads rescued. That's nice. Okay, well, we did it. We, uh, we went ahead and saved the people and stuff, and yeah. All right, next time on Paper Mario the Origami King, we're going to see about that tower and maybe break our first ribbon. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll stock up on some items, and I'll see you next time. Take it easy. Class dismissed.